it's me Jelly, and welcome back to my channel i am back with another video i am back with another episode of my self-care diaries and in this video i am finally going to be showing you how i take care of my hair after washing so on the first part of my hair care routine video i showed you guys how i wash my hair so the complete routine, I showed it to you and I already did that today. And as you can see, my hair is very damp right now. But in this video, I'm going to be showing you kung ano naman yung mga products na ginagamit ko and also how I use it on my hair after na siyang ma-wash. And so basa nga yung hair ko because I'm going to be showing it to you guys right now. But before we move on to that, I just want to again reiterate yung mga things that I do on my hair before and after ko ma-discover tong hair care routine ko. So if you guys know me for um, a very long time, you guys know that my hair went through a lot. I don't really care much about my hair as much as I care about my skin, my face, something like that. So wala talaga akong paki sa aking buhok. And I don't necessarily use products to take care of my hair. I just simply shampoo my hair condition my hair and that's it but after discovering tong hair care routine na to, a lot has changed and especially so confidence ko on my hair and everything so you guys know that uh, my hair went through a lot i bleached it a lot of times already i colored it a lot of times already i will cut it very short will make it grow longer and then cut it very short again and then color my hair every now and then which resulted to my very damaged hair and if you guys don't know before i discovered this hair care routine i only comb my hair once a day talagang after gumaligo yun lang i may comb my hair finger comb my hair for the entire day like mga once or twice but that's it i only comb it using a real comb once a day so talagang tangle yung hair ko it's very dry it's very damaged ayun nga, in addition to all the colors that i did to my hair and then finally, I realized that self-care hindi lang siya limited to your skin and everything, but your overall self. And so, I decided to take care of my hair. Apologies for the noise. So, yeah, I decided to take care of my hair. And this is the result. So, may mga products na ipapakita sa inyo. I actually only have three products that I'm going to be showing you. But there's like an additional one. So, let us begin with first is this one so this is the first product this is the vitress hair polish so this is the first product that i put on my hair after ko maligo so just like a nail polish it will make your hair pretty diba parang makintab yung nails mo and everything so ganun din yung ginagawa niya sa hair ko this hair polish um helps my hair be shiny and looking healthy, especially after I blow dry my hair. So I always use it on a damp hair, but you can use this one on a dry hair. Pero ako mas prefer ko and mas um, mas comfortable ko ilagay siya on my damp hair. So that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. So again, this one is it keeps my hair shiny and um, soft. Mas malambot siya kapag kaginagamit ko to after ko mag blow dry. I'm just gonna lather it on my hand and then just do this. Spread it all over. Actually, think I'm running out of this. Um, this one has a smell in it. Mabango naman siya, but I prefer the blue one. Pero I tried this pink one. Pero pareho silang mabango and also keeps your hair shiny and healthy looking. So I will add another one. So ito, super nice. I've been using it for quite a long time na. And it's really good. It does keep my hair shiny. At all times, I really like that product. So I, but I also mentioned that I blow dry my hair every day. I, I mean, every single time that I wash my hair, I blow dry it because I found out that when you let your hair air dry, mas matagal siyang matuyo, di ba? So it's more damaging to your cuticles than to just dry it with a blow dryer. And I know you guys will say blow dryer it has heat, so it would. Um, um, it could also damage your hair. But at least with blow dryer, you can use heat protectants to protect your hair 
And again, masaglit mo siyang gagawin. So, mas masaglit yung exposure mo. Hindi ganun ka lalayang damage compared to when you are just air drying your hair. So, it's much better to um, blow dry your hair. And, sabihin niyo din, baka sabihin niyo na it takes so much of your time. I know. Because may mga times din na pag maliligo ako, I have to go already when running errands. So, what I do is just, I blow dry it, siguro mga 50% or at least 30% na dry it siya. Para medyo mabilis na din yung pag i air dry ko sa kanya. So, I am done putting the hair polish, which is in the chest one. I will try to link all the products I'm gonna be mentioning on the description box below. Moving on to the second product that I use. I use this Ceviche na all-in-one leave-in hair conditioner. So this is what it looks like. Ayan. So this is a leave-on or yeah, leave-in hair conditioner. So basically it's a conditioner but you can leave it on your hair again. I prefer using this on a damp hair than on a dry one. Kasi mas comfortable ako ilagay siya. And again, conditioner siya which will make your hair more shiny, more soft, more manageable. Pero ang kagandahan nito is, pwede mo siyang ilagay sa hair mo and leave it on your hair. There are actually hair masks na leave on then But I am using this one. This one is strawberry flavored one which smells good. And it's really nice. And it keeps my hair really looking good and smelling good. This one with this one, I'm not afraid to ayun nga, um, let it on my scalp or sa roots ko kasi hindi naman, hindi naman yung ginagawang very oily yung aking hair. So, this is what I do. Actually, may mga yung nga hair mask, and depende na sa inyo yun kung anong gusto nyo gamitin. So, again, disclaimer. Itong routine na to is it works for me because I've been doing this for quite a long time na. And so it works for me but it does not necessarily mean that it would work for you. Again, if you guys want to follow a certain routine, hindi lang yung routine ko and then you want to use certain products, do your research first and see what works for you because what works for you might not work for me or what works for me might not work for you. So all of these products that I'm showing you and all of this routine practices that I'm showing you is working for me. So, do your research first. You can follow, but see it na makita mo muna na nag-work siya sa'yo before you continue doing it. So, yun lang. Um, again, I am using this two products, my hair polish, and then yung conditioner, yung leave-on conditioner. But, depende sa inyo, you can actually use a leave-on conditioner and a leave-on hair mask to your hair to manage it after you wash it. Or, pwede rin namang hair polish and a leave-on hair mask. Depende sa inyo. Try and see what works for you. But, this one is what works for me. I can add yung hair mask na leave-on, but I feel like it would be a tedious process for me na adding another product. Because, um, hindi naman every time na ganito kadami yung time ko to actually all, do all of this. So, sobrang haba ng time ko washing my hair kasi nga matagal talaga with all of those routines that I, uh, with all of those things that I do on my hair care routine that I showed you guys. So, kung dadamihan ko pa yung mga products na gagamitin ko after, then baka may na ako. So, yeah. So, these are the first two products and the last product that I'm um, that I use on my hair, yung talagang part of my hair care routine is this one. So, ito ay ang heat primer or like a heat protectant. And this one is in cream form. So, ang kagandahan nito, I really love this specific na leave-on or I mean heat protectant. Because this one, first off, it really smells good. It is really affordable. And also, hindi lang siya basta heat protectant. It also makes my hair smooth. Oh yeah, I was so surprised the first time that I used this kasi sobrang lambot talaga ng hair ko. And so, pag bin dry ko siya, maganda siya tignan. Hindi siya yung may mga heat protectants kasi na um, yung mga ini-spray. Sometimes it leaves a white cast on your hair. So, it's annoying. But this one is not. It's just like all the products that I showed you guys, parang ganun lang siya. But it's heat protectant. Plus, it smells good. And also, um, it makes your hair softer and mas madali siyang suklay and mas malambot talaga siya. So, this one, I put generously on my hair. 
like so. So, una muna dito sa taas. O siya focus. I tried to make sure na most of the sections of my hair is well coated with this product. And then I'll just comb it and proceed to blow drying my hair, which I'm gonna be doing later on after I film this video. But anyway, so I know na sinabi ko, there are only three products, but there is like an additional one, which is not really a main product that I use on my hair, like after washing. But this one, I believe So this one is like an additional product that I use on my hair. So this is the Vitress na hair freshener. So parang air freshener, it would make the air fresh. Mubango and everything. This one is just like that. There's a hair ball. Now, this one, I discovered it from Marian. She was the one who recommended it to me because one time, kakatapos lang namin uminom, pagkagising namin, we decided to eat some gyopsal. And then, pagbalik namin sa kondo niya, ayaw pa namin maligo and everything. And we just want to, you know, be horizontal and just rest. So, sabi ko, Mar, how can I lay down if my hair smells like this? Because if you guys have been eating some gyopsal, you guys know na your hair would literally smell like smoke. And then, pag humiga ka, didikit talaga siya sa kahit anong dikitan mo. Even your clothes would smell like smoke. So, this is the best tool to beat that smoke smelling hair of yours after your samgyup day. Okay, sobrang ganda niya. So, the first time I sprayed it, one spray, the smell is gone. I am swearing by this one. This product is really, really good. So one spray na wala agad yung amin ng samgyopsal. I am not even kidding. And then Morian said, Go Jeff, spray mo lang ng spray ng madaming beses. I sprayed it all over my head. And my hair is smelling like a flower. Parang kakalabas ko lang ng shower. It was really that good. So I always carry this one around. When I go out, kasi nga, Sobrang bango talaga niya. And kunwari, ayun nga, humain ka ng samgyu. Pero later that night, you have a party na may pupuntahan ka pa. So, this one is really good to mask that, you know, um, smelly hair you have. I know it's kind of gross, but it is what it is. And then, um, this one, I always use it on the second day of washing my hair. Kasi diba, hindi ko na wash yung hair ko. So, on the second day, I use this para lang um, amoy fresh yung aking buhok. So I think this is already the end of the video. I'm glad na hindi to kasing haba nung isa. But yeah, that's all of the products that I use on my hair after washing. So again, please remember yung disclaimer ko kanina that this product worked for me but it might not work for you. So please, please, please before you follow a routine or use um, the same products that you guys see on um, any social media sites, please make sure you do your research first so, so that alam nyo na it will really work for you. So yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you, thank you so much guys for following me along my self-care diaries and um, I'll be putting out more videos to show how I take care of myself. So please keep on watching and please keep on supporting. Bye! I will see you on my next one.